Hey everyone, it's Andrew from MAO Magic, and I am here with the Misfit Wearables Bet It Sleep System. This is a partnership between Misfit Wearables and Bet It, who originally uh, started this product, and it was a self-starter campaign, I believe. And then they've partnered with Misfit, who are the makers of the Shine, the popular uh, you know activity tracker. Um, the Shine uh, monitors your sleep at night but you have to wear it. So you do have to wear something on your wrist, like the actual shine, it's the shine itself, or if you have a jawbone, something like that. Now this is supposed to do the same thing, but gives you more features and you don't have to wear anything. So you can literally take off the shine at night. This will track your sleep and it'll bring them together in the shine app. So obviously this is uh, made by Bedit here and it's kind of like a joint partnership. It's like the same thing, but they put like the Misfit logo on the box and everything like that. But it seems to be, it is the same product if you just buy it straight through Bedit. Bedit actually has their own separate app, so you don't have to use the Misfit one if you aren't using like the Shine. But it's supposed to be best used with the Shine, Shine during the day, the Bedit at night. Um, and it does offer a few more features than the actual, actual Shine itself. So the Shine will measure when you're asleep, when you wake up. Um, it'll also measure your light sleep versus your deep sleep. The bed it, however, will measure your total sleep time, your sleep cycles, the deep versus light sleep, uh, when you woke up, either in the morning as well as during the night, your heart rate, as well as the ambient sound slash snoring. So it basically tracks when you're snoring as well. It also has stuff like the smart alarm. So when you're getting close to being woken up, it'll wake you within like you know a certain amount of your uh, scheduled wake up time. Now, as you can see, it has just an adhesive, so it just attaches to your bed, whatever, right below your sheet. So if you have like a mattress cover or anything like that, it goes onto there, and it'll just stick with that adhesive. And then it's a it's USB powered, so you can plug it into a uh, some type of computer if you'd like. But really, it comes with a wall adapter, so you're gonna need an outlet next to your bed, which we're assuming everyone's going to have anyway. So to install, it's it's pretty basic. You purely pull off the. Uh, the backing on the back of the bed it and then you're just going to adhere about chest level so you're really like basically so this is going to measure your um all this stuff the sleep cycles the awake times heart rate so all that stuff it's going to measure it using ballistiocardiography which is a bcg and just going to measure this is like a force tracker which is what that uh the film basically that we're applying to your mattress so that's how it's going to measure. So it's going to measure the force of your breathing or your heart rate. Um, and that's it. That's really all it's going to do. It's going to pair using Bluetooth to your phone or to your iPad if you want to run the iPhone app on your iPad. Uh, this also will need access to your microphone. So that's how it's going to measure your snoring. It's going to listen to you know the ambient noises overnight and then it'll record that and let you know how much you snored and when. So it's pretty easy if you look here, um, if we look at... This is the Shine app. So you can use the Bedit one. We are going to use the Misfits, the Misfit app here. So if we go back to a day before I started testing out the Bedit, you can see that's what we got here. How long I slept, how long was deep sleep, how long was light sleep, and that that's really it. So if we jump forward to when we have the, the Bedit installed, we get a lot more information here. You can see the light sleep versus deep sleep, the heart rate, how much I snored, this will even swipe up here and I can see a lot more information as well. So I can, don't pull up control center, but I can see a graph of light sleep versus deep sleep when I woke up during the night and when I was snoring throughout the night. My biggest complaint is what does this mean? Okay, cool. So I know that I, you know, snored. How is that affecting me? Here's my heart rate. Okay. Obviously it drops down when I'm, when you're going to sleep. Um, what does that mean? There's my heart rate right there, uh, you know, just over 60. Is that good or is that bad? I don't know, and it's not telling me. The thing I liked about the jawbone was that it was so nice in telling me um, what I could do to improve myself and what was good, what was bad. This is giving me no indications. So here you can set your smart alarm, which will just wake up, wake you up when you're at your lightest point of sleep. It's very easy to add or to, you have to do this every night though. You just hit the use bed it to sync sleep. And then it'll pop up with that accessory list. You're going to choose it and then it's going to track. So you have to leave like your phone. You can close it, but let that run all night. Uh, the biggest problem though is like you have to do that every single night. You can't get into bed and it'll take care of it. You literally have to open up the app, hit bed it, leave your app running, close your phone, let it run all night. So I do wish that was a little bit more automated. 
This is going to run $150 through Bedit or through Misfit. Um, check it out. If you have any questions, throw them up in the comments. Other than that, subscribe, and I will see you guys all next time. <laughs>